Yeah, he's like, oh, I can't believe I have to clean up this moldy sink. Oh. Hey everyone, it's Pixelina and welcome to this video where I am going to be going over the November updates uh, features. So the first thing I'm going to be going over with you guys is the repairman. They finally, thank you EA, thank you so much for adding this. They finally added repairman. Thank you, Jesus, because I was freaking going out of my mind, you know, repairing and replacing. And you know what? We couldn't have that anymore. So finally, we have the repairman back. I'm so happy for this. And I know I am a little late or maybe a lot late, you know. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and quickly go ahead and just show you uh, how this works. So we're going to go ahead and I guess use the bathroom enough to break it. So let's go ahead and buy the cheapest um, shower we have in the game. So we'll go ahead and buy this one right here. It should break within a few uses. So I will get back. Alrighty guys, so it is now broken. And yeah, our neighbors are here. They're just like, oh, okay. I guess we're not wanted here. You know, it's cool. You're not. We're just here to do a review. So we're going to go ahead and hire a repair service. So this is pretty much the new uh, interaction we have here. So she's going to go ahead and hire. She's like, hey, uh, my my shower just broke because I finished using it like eight, about eight times. So here you get a little pop up saying, thanks for hiring from Repair Service Services United. Your repair technician will arrive on Sunday at 11, 12 a.m. So it arrives roughly within, I want to say, 20, 25 minutes or 30 minutes max. So he should be he or she actually you can it can be a female or a male, uh. So yeah, here he is. And by the way, little thing I want to point out to you guys: the repairman in in this world in uh, Oasis Springs wear a red um uh, uniform, and the ones in Willow Creek and I guess greener places wear it blue. Uh, that's just from what I've been able to pick up on. Maybe that's not the case, but, you know, here he is with his little uh, belt of handy dandy supplies and tools and things like that. So he's going to come and go and just walk inside, you know. He just walks in. He goes in the bathroom. He uh, cleans everything. And we are going to do another test, okay. We're going to we're gonna break all the things in the house, and you guys are going to see if it... if you know, if it's kind of a hoax and he they, he still needs working on and only fixes about one thing in the house, so watch. He's just going to stand here for a little bit until he leaves. Everything looks fixed up and in shape. Time for me to go. That will be 105 simoleons. So, yeah, it's roughly about 100 simoleons every time. But I will get back to you guys once we have broken most of the um, appliances. Alrighty, so as you guys can see, we went ahead and moved towns just so that I can prove, you know, this theory of mine of the whole repairman wearing blue in Willow Creek and repairman wearing red in Oasis Springs. So as you guys can probably tell, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine things to repair in this home. Now, you can probably identify the fact that it is no longer a Saturday, was it? I don't know. But it's it's been about uh, one to two days, and I pretty much had her do these, these things, you know, reuse, 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 until they broke, and I pretty much just tried to stick with the cheapest of the cheap. So the fridge is broken. Everything is freaking broken. So we're going to go ahead and call the repair service and we are going to see if this is uh if ea got all this figured out because look at the amount of things we have broken so you know what i think this is a pretty thorough review if you ask me so uh, yeah thanks for hiring from repair services united your repair technician will arrive on tuesday at 8 56 p.m so yeah uh i'd say 30 to 45 minutes maximum would be the time that it takes for him to get here 
And my theory is utterly incorrect. They can wear, I mean, the color does not depend on the town. It just, it's completely random. So here he comes, you know, get out, get away from the sink, girl. Just come here, sit, watch some TV, you know. So, gonna try to surf here. He's going ahead and fixing the shower first. Let's see what else he does. He's like, ooh, what a mess, what a mess. We have puddles all over the place. Come on. Oh, oh, by the way, here are our interactions. I totally forgot about this. All right, so we can dismiss him. We can fire him. We can give him a friendly introduction, a funny introduction. We can give him a $100 tip, okay? We're going to do that at the end of all this. And we can give him a rude introduction, of course. So if you wanted to sleep with the repairman, feel free, girl. Feel free. It is, you know, all up to you. It's all up to you. And here, you know, when you hover over him, it says repair service and ASA law. So, and he is an adult. So he's doing as told. He's fixing all of our broken items, which is very good. He, although he, he missed out on the sink over here. I'm hoping that he uh, cleans it up or fixes it actually. Yeah, he's like, oh, I can't believe I have to clean up this moldy sink. Oh. All right, well, we're going to speed through this real fast. And there he goes, cleaning up the sink. So, wow, it is actually uh, not a hoax. It is actually very legit. So, wow, I am I'm very impressed. No bugs. He is doing it as he is told. He hasn't just been standing around doing nothing for hours. So, I have to, you know... I have to give it to you, EA. Nice. Nicely done with this patch. So we're going to come here and give him a friendly introduction and go ahead, uh, go ahead and give him a $100 tip. She, I think she has gained a little weight. Oh, there it is. All right. So it's kind of like a, a packet. And her face is like, here you go. My pleasure. He's like, oh, thanks. And so, yeah, that's a pop-up comes up saying thanks, and that's pretty much it. Can we do anything after that? You know, we can give him another tip if we want. We can ask him for repair advice. Let's see how much uh, it brings up our handiness skill, if it does at all. So we have acquired it. Let's go ahead and try, the, try that. I'm sorry, I cannot talk. I'm so sorry. I guess they, she can't ask him for any more tips or anything like that. Go ahead and tip him one more time. You know, we're filthy rich, so why the heck not? Okay, so go ahead and give him another tip. Thanks, same pop-up. All right, so that's pretty much what happens. Nothing too, too crazy. But I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the furniture items that came with the patch. Alrighty guys, so I'm going to go ahead and show you the things that we received. Uh, we received about three items from the trick or treat little competition. Um, if you guys don't know about it, it's pretty much this competition that went on as a little Halloween, you know, thing, fun little thing to do. So your sims got the interaction to either trick your other sims or treat them. So they would just give them candy whenever they would treat them. And when they would trick them, they would like scare them or something like that. So I thought that was pretty cute and whatever team won, you know, whatever whatever um, interaction was used the most would be rewarded with that kind of um, reward. So if, if team trick won, we would be rewarded with trick related um, treats and if team treat won, we were rewarded with <laughs> treat related um, objects. So. We're going to go ahead and go over the first one, which is the Edgar the Generous store. Uh, it's 50 simoleons, and it says, Edgar, a lion of generous repute, always shared his labor's fruits, never without an ounce of doubt, can any of his generosity refute. So we're going to go ahead and put this here. I will show you guys the several colors that this comes in. So it comes in black, gray, brown, brown dark brown and silver so it pretty much it's a basic door with some stuff on it making it look all creepy you know you know and we're gonna go ahead and look at the other side of this it's just a line with a little knock knock thing on it that's what i like to call it at least that little circle right here and so yeah it's nothing you know too too crazy 
but I think it is pretty darn cool maybe for a haunted house or something like that when your sim is having a spooky party so the next item is in fact a bowl a fish bowl so let's see if actually we're gonna go ahead and look in activities and skills miscellaneous and here it is it is the gumber fish bowl so I'm not gonna read this huge description but it's just basically a bowl where you can add a fish or purchase a guppy fish which is pretty much the whole point of the fish bowl but it's it's you know you can add your own fish to this wonderland of a fish bowl and pretty much the oh actually you guys cannot change this red color right here it's like unchangeable which is kind of unfortunate but you know what it's cool it's 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 cool it's fine so here we have a little gingerbread wonderland type thing we can we have the option of purchasing a fish you know a guppy fish for 15 simoleons or we can add a fish if we have one in our inventory so we are going to go ahead and just purchase the guppy fish and this is what it looks like so it is a cute little gummy looking fish right here so 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 cute i love it and it looks so adorable with that little wonderland in the back like the, the gingerbread house oh it's just so so nice so i think it's gonna go very well you know maybe during christmas time or something like that i think it would be very very nice so now i'm gonna go ahead and go over a few of the fixes that ea brought into the game all right, so the first fix is that they addressed the issue that could prevent the maid from arriving during their normally scheduled work hours if they attempted to arrive for work on a weekend. The So maids should now properly work their Monday through Friday shifts and will no longer attempt to work overtime on the weekends. The next one is as they are introducing the repair service to the team, they notice long periods of time where the repair person would stand doing absolutely nothing. This also occurred for other repair services such as the maid. We have adjusted or they have adjusted the do nothingness quote unquote for the service and PCs and are happy with the lessening of the nothingness time. So, uh... The next one is you can now remove a fish from a fishbowl if the power is off. So it's, it's you know, th that's good to know. That's, that's a nice fix. And they also address an issue where several foundation issues would result in a sim being unable to properly route over foundations within some lots in your town. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe and I will talk to you all very soon. If you have any questions, just leave them down in the comments below. And yeah, until my next video. Bye everyone.